Hello everyone and welcome back to Psychonauts in the Rhombus of Ruin. I'm going to pause the game because I found out how to do it. There we go. On the last episode of Psychonauts in the on the last episode, we started the game, found out that we're literally seeing through the eyes of 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 uh Raz as we are currently on our way to try and find out what happened to Lily's dad, the head of the Psychonauts, you know, leaving off where we were at the beginning at the end of Psychonauts 1. Uh, Mia's here, Sasha's here, Oleander's here, and we got our tutorials on how to control the game, and we also got our ability to, uh, jump into people's minds using clairvoyance, which allows us to see their perspective. Uh, using that, we use an item that Truman left behind to jump to his perspective and find out exactly where he was using some context clues and, you know, using the people around to uncover stuff about the, ba about the base that they were in. Turns out they're in a base in the middle of the Rhombus of Ruin, kind of like the, the Bermuda Triangle, which is a old classified Psychonauts facility that has a bunch of bad psychic rocks there. Uh, unfortunately, on our way there, we seem to have crash landed. So now we're now we're just a victim, although we're we're currently in a torture chair, so that's not great. So we got to find a way out. So, uh, yeah, we can only really, we, it seems like we can't move. Maybe there's another code to open that other window. Yeah, because we're just standing there, so we can't actually, like, move, move. We have to use our clairvoyance to warp from spot to spot because, because VR game. So, oh, you know what? I bet this guy, hold on. I bet hmm. this guy. What's down here? I mean, this looks like a toilet. My telekinesis feels busted. I can't get a grip. Oh, sorry. Ooh, look at that. Is something taped to that mirror? Can't see from here. It's anglerfish, anglerfish, pufferfish, anglerfish. I mean, I could do this. There we go. I yep. really got to get out of this room. Can't see myself in that rusty mirror. Probably for the best. Well, we didn't get a, we didn't get like a sound effect. Oh, well, at least we know what the button combination is. Hey, you. All right, so it was anglerfish, anglerfish, pufferfish, anglerfish. Ah, that powers that thing up. Okay, was that even available last time? I don't think it was. This one looks like the button master. So, this is how it feels to be the button master. Yeah, look at the big button. All right. Here we go. What the? Wow! That's incredible! Ooh, uh-oh. Okay. Bye, room! We're, we're leaving this place. Hello, fish. So this is what it's like to be underwater. Hey, the door's closing. I'm stuck out here. Oh, that's right. I'm not really out here. I wonder where the jet is. Did it sink down to the bottom? Are the others inside? I've got to get down there and find them. Oh. I'm usually terrified of water, but since I'm only doing it mentally, I can actually enjoy it for once. Yeah. All right, we could take a look. Okay, so there's a there's a bunch of boats. There's a there giant rocket. There was an issue of true psychic tales that talked about the rhombus of ruin, but I assumed it was just a legend. But it looks pretty real to me. Yeah. There's a how to train get here. According to True Psychic Tales issue 43. The heart of the rhombus of ruin is an enormous silerium deposit. So powerful it can confuse and attract the minds of pilots and captains for miles and miles, like a deadly mental magnet. Well, that seems the to be- Psychonauts tried to set up research stations like this one to study it, but no one could bear the silerium mental effects. Well, it looks like a giant brain down there. Got a giant mine, there's a UFO, and a submarine, and another fish, giant rocket. There's a car over there for some reason. Mm, all right, well, we can't go backwards, so we just gotta go, we gotta go forwards. Oh, no, new fish, okay, yep. Yeah. Oh, I guess the fish back there moved. Ugh. I feel like I'm about to fall over. Oh, here comes the fish I get to warp to. 
Cool, what's in here? Oh, there goes another fish. Uh, nothing really. Sorry about the very sudden movements. It looks like we're going to the car. There's some lights coming out of that thing over there. That's what I can hear. Uh, yep, yep. Did not expect to see one of these here. Yeah. Okay, so there's a fighter plane. There's a couple of tanks. Look like the tanks that we had to fight in Psychonauts 1. Hi, Mr. Worm. How's it going? Fish is way over there now. Can we warp to it? Maybe not from this. Oh! Okay. Hi, Fishy. Oh, okay. I guess solid. Wow. I guess glasses and print Look at all that Silurium glow. Look at all these vehicles. Uh-huh. So many vehicles. Guided here by what? Silurium poisoning? Psychomagnetism? I mean, I just made that term up. But it sounds as right as anything. I can feel it now. Twisting my mind. I wonder how it's affecting the others. I guess I'll find out. I do like the giant blimp that's down there. Okay. Mid-mission status report. Plane crashed. Team separated. I'm tied to a chair. Psy powers not working. Weird silent guards everywhere. I'm gonna put those in the challenges column. Under opportunities, not dead yet. Some power's still working. And I'm learning a lot about fish. <laughs> That's a I just need to find Lily and Sasha and Mia soon. Oh, and Coach, him too. Yeah, Coach. Co I got to get down there and find them. Coach is a good guy now. Also, that's a cruise ship. Heh. Huh. I thought jellyfish didn't have brains. Guess this is one of the smart ones. Okay. Yeah. Uh. All right. Up oh, there we go. Make s'mores, not wars. <laughs> No one in the driver's seat, huh? Visit the questionable area. I guess we're going somewhere, huh? Where are the fish leading us? Oh, that fish is already there. Okay. Oh, well now I'm just trapped. Kind of fun trying to find out where the next next fish is going to be. Uh, Maybe that fell off a boat. Yeah, out of a giant giant uh, ocean liner. S H M. Hmm. Not much of a view from down here. No, I mean we're at the giant ceruleum deposit. All right, we gotta open I this up. If one of my friends is locked in a shipping container. Uh, that would be bad. There's no oxygen down here. Open and reveal your kidnapped psychonauts. Hey, anybody in there? I can't see from here. Uh, is there someone I can see from? Nope. <laughs> Don't explode, don't explode, don't explode. Ah, that works. Okay. Ah, much better view. Although I feel a little bloated. I wonder if I could have done anything with the previous puffer fish. Uh oh, got sharks. And a school bus. 
Wow, look at that Silerium deposit. Where did it come from? And why does it look so much like a brain? That is a good question. I'm going over here. That's one big ship. A riverboat. Why is a riverboat in the middle of the ocean? So we have to find Sasha, Mia, Lily, the coach. Ew. I hope the kids got off before this bus sank. Well, there's a train. Can I do anything with the train? Looks like a train engine. Wonder where the rest of it is. Huh, there's someone there's someone in the boat. Looks like a switch for the train track. I need to save the children. Mia! What are you doing? It's like she's in some sort of trance. This thing is airtight? Cool, okay. Wow. Okay, let's head up to Mia. Aw, oh, man. Mia would love this song. Oh, yeah, this guy's wearing headphones. What are you looking at? Oh. Oh. I don't think I can hold this for much longer. She's holding the train back. Mia, can you hear me? I can't talk now, Rasputin. This bus is caught on the tracks and it's taking all my strength to hold back this train. I need to save the children. Oh, man. Oh, and there's no battery left. I can honk the horn. Hey, there's the engine. I'd try to get it started, but I don't think driving out of here is very likely. Oh, but there's an electric eel right there. Hold on. Stop. Hmm, this button is some sort of hexagon, but strangely, with eight sides. Everything is so weird here. Okay, you can go. Oh, I gotta stop him in time for the- Hey, eel. Halt. Okay, can I, like, push- Oh, wait, can I do this? Looks like the battery's out of juice. Hey, where'd that eel go? Guess he didn't want to show his face after the battery sucked all the juice out of him. But I still need more power. We've got some power, but not much. Well, I mean, what can I do? Okay, so me is being affected by the Cerulean so that she sees all of, like, the other people here as children. Yeah. Yeah, we're all just, we're all just normal people. Just innocent men. Mia, I need your help to find the other Psychonauts. I need to save these orphans first. Orphans? Yeah. <laughs> A bus full of orphans about to be hit by a train. Okay, what can I do to... We have a little bit of battery now that we capture that eel. Uh, oh, you can use the radio. Cool. I never had a school bus with a radio in it. Of course, I never had a school bus, period. You know, growing up in the circus and all. No good. The power's dead. I need something to break me out of this trance. Resume swimming. Oh, that even stopped. Okay, hold on. Whoops. Watch out, fish. So, okay, so I need to... Freeze! I'll bet the manual for that battery specifically states, do not submerge battery in seawater for years. As you were. Okay. Red light. We're almost full power. One more. You're free to go. Stop. I'm so sorry, Mr. Eel. We're full up. Oh, now the radio works. Okay. Oh, and the lights are on. Uh. Okay, so this one changes the number one. Or two, I guess. And this one changes uh, a whole number. All right, well, who... I guess someone here probably has a code. Oh, wow. Mia, 
You think those weird guards are little children? I can't fail the orphans again, Rasputin. Oh, yeah, that's right. Her tragic backstory. Okay, maybe someone here has a clipboard. Hey, what's your clipboard say? Oh, I guess I can't read it. Oh! Screwball. Oh. This one looks like the studious type. That's very mean. Uh, who else has a... Who else has one? I one of these guards knows something. I'm looking. You have a... I think you have a clipboard. Oh, you have a clipboard? Hey! I need to save the children. Oh! I don't know who these guys are, but this one really likes his tunes. Huh. The buttons don't work on that radio. 104.1. Oh, yeah, it's a sign that Mia would like. Okay. Oh, well, let's use that number then. I don't think I can hold this for much longer. 104.1. All right. Uh... Hello? Hello? Sasha. Is anyone there? How is he on the radio? Why do I think they'll understand my earthling language? Or are they so advanced they can understand any language? We know so little. Anything is possible. We are so insignificant. Why would they even bother talking to us? Still, I must try. This is historic. What does this dial do? Does this change anything? Testing, testing. This is Sasha 9 from planet Earth. We have found one of your vehicles. Unfortunately, no one aboard survived. Hmm. I hadn't considered their reaction to the loss of their vehicle and its crew. <gasps> what if they blame us for the crash? What if they blame me? Have I just Yikes. the wrath of a bastard? I'm glad my body's not species? here with me. What choice Those do sharks I look in really the face hungry. Of scientific history. Who am I to stand in the way of our destiny? Even if that destiny is our destruction. This is for the good of science. And what value is there to humanity? But the truths we have collectively discovered. Painful though they were to learn, I must press on. I must break through. He okay. Hello to any sentient being that might. He's on the he's on the UFO. <laughs> he's on the UFO that we saw. Piano music, nice. Rasputin, where are you? Who are these people? Mia. We were in a plane crash. I'm in the research outpost. I think those guards work for Truman's kidnappers. And our kidnappers too, it seems. Are you with the others? No. We have to go find them. Of course. But I don't think I can do much of anything right now, Rasputin. Something's wrong. Something's wrong with me. It's the Silerium. It's messing up our brains. I think I can resist it. Mori always said your brain was armored like a tank. I think the best way for me to help is to focus my psychic energy on you, young man. I focus on boosting your telekinetic ability, just in case you run into any more runaway trains. But I can't do it alone, Mia. You won't be alone, darling. I'll be in your thoughts, listening to everything you think. Yikes. <laughs> now that I have my TK back, what should I try to lift first? Oh, we got our telekinesis back, okay. Which is the trigger and then the control sticks. Okay, well, I mean, we have that. Oh. Huh. Ross, what have you done? Uh, well, uh, I have a plan. Kind of. See? Exactly as I planned. Oh, Ross. You didn't think I was gonna, you know, you didn't think I was gonna have this be hit by a train, right? Huh? Maybe we turn it back over to Sasha's channel and see what's happening. Can't side blast anything with my head all messed up like this. I better not touch it. I think this music helps Mia's meditation. Ah, yeah. If she, if we turn it off of this, she'd probably revert back to normal. Can't get a connection. Oh, looks like we can't connect with the sharks. Hey, the light's on in that bomber over there. How long have we been recording for for that episode? Oh, yeah, there's the UFO up there. 
There's the bomber over there with the lights are on. Hold on, I'm just taking my headphones off. Oh, I'm looking in a completely different direction. Honestly, I feel like that might be another good cutoff point. Oh, the poor eels I sacrificed inside the school bus. Okay, new question. How is Mia going to get out of the school bus? I mean, I guess she maybe could form like a psychic barrier around herself to pre like prevent her from drowning. But how is she going to get anywhere? Where's our body? I forgot where our body is. Our body is in like the facility way up there. So, you know, we got to find a way there. Uh, I mean, we have a jellyfish. Looks like we're going to head over to the bomber next. <laughs> we know that Sasha's in the UFO. So who could be in the bomber? And where else could we possibly find another person at? Uh, inside the ship? Where's the, where's the cruise ship at? Cruise ship is over here. I did see light somewhere. I don't remember where, though. There's the giant blimp. I don't remember where the cruise ship is. It's right up there. Oh, Mia's having trouble with something. Okay. Hi, Mr. Sharky. Can't get a connection. Okay, so it won't let us connect to the sharks. Maybe they... Can't get a connection. Maybe they just have two tiny brains. Well... That's going to do it for this episode. Oh, God, this is all crooked. Uh, okay, I guess I can't fix this. Never mind. Okay, okay, okay. So, on the next episode of Psychonauts and the Rhombus of Ruin... Ow! Okay, that's my table right there. We will continue on. We've rescued Mia. We got to go find Sasha, Lily, and Oleander still. Also rescued Truman. So... Once we do that, we just got to rescue ourselves. Hooray. Who's that? I'm just looking at the figments and trying to remember who everyone is. I don't remember a bunny man. All right. Well, until next time. Hopefully you enjoy.